Hey guys, welcome to the mobile edition of the Mixed Coach Insider podcast. Uh, we are literally driving down the road, and I think my little girl just woke up, if you can see her, and my wife is driving very well, and uh, just wanted to uh, bring you this uh, episode, uh, because this is the last chance I'm going to get. I, I don't have a whole lot of cell service after after this, or any uh, internet connection, so uh this is a combination of episode four of the Mix Coach Insider, and it's a wrap-up of Randy Miller's mix. And uh, so we'll get right to Randy's Randy's mix. The uh, submissions are now officially closed for Randy's mix, and he has picked a winner, and I'll announce that toward the end of the show. But I just wanted to say um, thank you guys for being so kind and so thoughtful and so helpful to each other. It's really, really exciting for me to know that uh, I get to hang out with you guys on this forum, and I get to you know learn from you guys, and maybe you get to learn something from me. We get to all learn something from each other. You're very helpful, and I just I want you to know that I appreciate that. I noticed uh, some of the comments that you were guys uh, that you were posting about others' mixes and how they could improve it, and uh, you know encouraging them to keep going. That, that's just awesome. Uh, I think I listened to all the mixes. I, I don't know how many there were, but I know that. There was one night I was up until 2 or 3 in the morning, and then there was another night that I was up at 3 until about 6 listening. So I tried to listen to all of them. I tried to leave you some comments on there that would help you. If I didn't, please be sure and let me know because I would love to hear your mix and uh, you know give you some feedback on it. And another thing, please, um, until we get this worked out, please don't take your mix down because the comments that are posted underneath your mix... Uh, are designed for that mix and if you take it down inadvertently uh, it's not really going to be helpful to anybody so if you would do me a favor and just leave it up there uh, indefinitely for now uh, until I can figure out a way for, you know for them to be on there more permanently and you don't have to uh, think about taking them down or not um, <clears throat> let's see um, Oh, if you're watching this and you're interested in getting in on some of this mixing stuff, which I think has been very helpful. I know I've learned a lot through the forum, but on this mix in particular, you know, there was a there was a lot of uh, creative things done that you could learn from. So if you, if you're not a member of Mix Coach Pro yet and you'd like to be, just go to mixcoach.com forward slash member and you can get some details there. Uh, okay, onward with the uh, episode. Uh, Next Tuesday, we are going to have another session up. Now, the session has not been determined yet because uh, I was thinking about this later on. I've got another mix that's kind of country, kind of sounding like it sounded kind of like Randy's mix. It's cut with different players, different musicians, and everything. And uh, I thought, would you like to have that so that you can apply everything you learned this past month? Or would you rather have something different? The different thing would be Christ Tabernacle Choir be a higher track track count but the reason I wanted to submit that is because they're actually up for a dove award and it will be or will not be awarded uh, in about two or three weeks Jan and I are driving to Atlanta to the award show and John and I were, were just talking about it and it, it might be kind of cool if you had that session to mix on let me know uh, there's a little poll around this video somewhere and if you're watching this on YouTube go to the link below and then go to the website and you know maybe you can check it out there but anyway the uh, um, the mix that we're putting up next month will be determined by you so just there's a two question poll uh, be sure and click that uh, I went to Belmont this past week and spoke at uh, Nathan Adams class about how to get work as a producer and I recorded the whole thing on video and I will be posting it on Mix Coach Member uh, pretty soon so be looking out for that uh, I think it's, uh, I, they ask, it was a Q&A session, they asked me several questions and I answered them as best I could and, you know, I recorded it and I'm going to put it up for you. Just remind me if, it, if it's not up in the next week or so. Uh, let's see, forum, the forum talk. Uh, there was one particular subject on the forum that kind of caught my eye. It was like, do you need a summing mixer to get commercial sounding mixes? And uh, that's been kind of a hot topic for me because I was pretty passionate about uh, my answer that you should learn to mix before you start worrying about all this uh, all this other stuff because there's there's a lot of 
uh, less expensive ways for you to learn how to mix than to go and buy a summing mixer. They're they're kind of they can be expensive, but anyway, check that on the forum if you get a chance, and if you're a member, comment. Um, let's see. I wanted to welcome a few new members too. Uh, my buddy Warren Drake in Franklin, North Carolina, signed up. Thank you, Warren. I have to give Warren a special shout out because several years ago, Warren's uh, path and my path uh, crossed when I was working in North Carolina. Warren, uh, we started a record on him that I still don't think we finished. Um, I know we haven't finished it. We finished parts of it, but anyway, Warren is responsible for me learning how to fly a plane, and Warren, I'll always be grateful for that. And uh, welcome to the site. I think if you haven't looked already, you're going to see that these members are awesome. If you've got any questions, uh, chime in there, and thank you for signing up. Uh, we've got a new guy named uh, Maurice Newsom, uh, Tia Imsong, or Imsong, I'm sure, Peter Bishop, uh, Sika, or Sika, with no last name, just S-I-C-A, straight up Sika. And then one I put to last because I know I'm going to butcher the pronunciation of it, but it is uh, Shramathi Rajogopalan. That's as close as I can get, I think. Um, Shramathi Raj, if you can uh, send me a message and let me know how to pronounce your name, I'll try my best to do uh, better next time. But uh, there's some new members, guys. If you uh, be sure and stop by and welcome them, uh, new members, be sure and go by the forum to the say hello part and, and introduce yourself. Tell us what about your studio. Excuse me. You okay? You're not <laughs> my little girl coughing. Anyway, okay. Let me go to this other page very quickly, and I'm going to announce the winner of the Randy Miller mixing contest. First of all, uh, there were several uh, really good mixes. Uh, Christian Stock Stockelmeyer did a great job. Uh, Daniel Abadie did a great job. Uh, Stone, although he didn't put the vocal in, uh, the track was sounding pretty good. It really was. Um, Kyle Hudgens, your mix was good, buddy. Um, and, and I'm known for getting some people. There were some people that did some really a really good job. I just thought I would, you know. Pick, pick a few people and mention their name to you. But the winner, drum roll please, Shannon, drum roll. <laughs> oh, thank you, Caleb. Uh, the winner is Louis Diaz. If you haven't heard Louis' mix, do yourself a favor and check it out. It is, uh, it's really good, Louis. He did a fantastic job. Randy picked it. It, uh, it sounded really good, and uh, he, he will be in contact with you pretty soon about just a couple of little tweaks that he wants to get done and but other than that it was a it's a great mix uh, go by and check out Randy uh, Louis mix and uh, give him a virtual pat on the back by letting him know that you heard it and uh, I'm sure that he'd be open to answer any questions and I think I if Louis if you're up for it I'll interview you and, and we'll go through step by step how you treated uh, this and put it in video form so okay that wraps up the um, episode the mobile version of episode four for the Mixed Coach Insider podcast. I want to thank you for being a member. I want to thank you for watching. And uh, I'll see you next week. Bye.